Hi, uh, today we are talking about the new oscilloscope, uh, this one called the Tektronics TBS 1032B digital oscilloscope. The new oscilloscope is different from the old oscilloscope because it's physically smaller than the old oscilloscope due to the absence of the cathode ray. The new oscilloscope has a USB port that allows you to take screenshots of your screen uh, so that you can be able to record your data in a better and efficient way. And there are like two colored uh, channels which allow you to, to observe your measurement, like the course of your measurement in a clearer way and very specific, efficient way. So how do we set up the scope? Here we will set up two function generators, one for each channel using BNC to BNC cables to connect them to the scope. Both of these generators right now are producing two different types of waves at different frequency. We will be using a sine wave to observe all, result, all res results. Both of these waves are color coded on the scope. Yellow is for channel 1 and blue is for channel 2. If you don't see them, push 1 and 2 on the vertical menu options. So about function of this scope, first you can, like you can see there's two waves on the graph. You can change the position of those waves by using this vertical position button. And there is another called scale, which can also change, you know, is scale of those channel 1 and channel 2. Yeah. Yeah, she's waving there. And there's a horizontal position which will like move them move both of them mm -hmm. left and right and use this to change the horizontal scale. Yeah. That is pretty dense. And as you can see on the oscilloscope, channel 1 is not moving, but channel 2 is moving. If you want to make channel 2 not moving, please press this triggers menu and change the source from channel 1 to channel 2 using this multi-purpose. Press the multi-purpose down, it's on channel 2. And yeah, you can see if the trigger is not, this horizontal line is not in intersect with channel 2, it's not going to take make any sense. So you put that into the wave and this stops channel 2. To measure these, like, scenes of those two waves, you press measure and choose like one of them. There's frequency, peak to peak, and a lot of other scenes. I'm just pick those three, and also for channel two. No. Yeah. So the maximum for you to have those on the bottom of the screen is six things. So th there's a question mark, so I change the horizontal scale, which gives another question mark. Yeah. Technology is great. Technology is great.